Today, I'm going to show you how to elevate your iPhone photos. Let's just see how we can elevate this image or, or make it a little bit more rich in these colors. So again, we're going to bring down the exposure, bring up the highlights, create a little bit of noise reduction. We're going to maybe just go down here to this calibration tool. A fun thing that someone has taught me before about this module is that if you want to keep something feeling natural, you don't really want to toggle too far outside of this these first like tick marks. And I fully agree. I think that a little bit of a an adjustment is is nice sometimes. Um, but but going over here, it's just unrealistic. And and you know, same with this. This green one, it's kind of just balancing it out here. Yeah, that's nice. And so I feel like honestly this this photo looks great already. Um yeah. we just kind of like evened it out a bit more and like leveled it out, made her skin pop. This is closer to how she looks in real life. The sky is a little bit more saturated without getting too unrealistic. Sometimes the sky would be really bright and really colorful. So it's cool that we can bring that out. For fun, let's use a select sky mask and see what we can do. Yes. Okay, it did a pretty great job of selecting the sky for us. Thank you, Lightroom. Mm -hmm. So now we're gonna go ahead and see if we can just add some fun color effects here. Make it feel more pink or purple. Add some more blues. That feels that feels actually pretty. Hmm. We don't want it to feel too unrealistic since it is a selfie. So let's keep it over here. Yeah. Now it looks like the highlights are a little bit too bright for me. So I'm just going to bring them down a bit. And let's see here bring out the shadows the details in the shadows a bit more let's bring down the whites mm, let's bring some of the whites back here that's nice yeah I like that's that. pretty nice i think that that is a good place to stop with that and then to exit out of your editing space you just click back on the icon and if you want to re-edit that you can go ahead and just click this tiny square which houses your mask let's compare once more mm. yeah yeah i like that Very cool that feels great bye, bye.